You know what's fucking sad these days, guys? You give someone a nice, brand new 2023 RGN, headache rack, all the fucking gear they need. Nice ass truck, 2018 truck, and treat them good, pay them good. Even when they're broke down, you pay them 2,000 a week to sit and watch fucking Netflix. This is the bullshit you get when you get it back. Truck was completely fucking detailed. Cigarettes, fucking dip cans fucking trash everywhere broke the fucking bed fucking paperwork every fucking where smells like smoke assholes and elbows in here completely filthy pieces everywhere bullshit everywhere like what the fuck man this was a nice truck now i have to pay fucking 300 bucks to get it detailed 400 500 who knows what the fuck is gonna be and this is the bullshit you get back broke all kind of bullshit Excuse me. Bungee quartz fucking stuck everywhere. Didn't even bother to wash it. Look at how fucking filthy that is. And we pay for the damn wash. And we pay for the damn washes. My faith in CDL drivers and humanity is gone, guys. And this is a guy that I actually trusted. And this is the condition in which he brought it back. So... No matter how good you are to people, don't matter. You can't pay them enough. Don't matter if it's fifteen hundred, two thousand, three thousand. It's never enough money. You know what I mean? Human beings just don't give a fuck. Selfish motherfuckers. Sad part is, I actually thought we were friends with this guy. Brought him to my house, invited him to dinner, bought him several dinners. You know, and this is the fucking way I get treated. All I know is that the guy's super lucky that he has a family, and I'm a nice guy. Otherwise, I'd blast him all over the internet, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube, you name it that not to hire this guy so yeah it's just it, speechless speechless you know you do good for people and uh this is the reward you get